Welcome to Furry Friend Zone, your cat and dog destination. Today we're going to show you, this is a little four month old toy poodle, and I'm going to show you just how to do a little quick face trim if you want to trim your puppy's face without having to get a full groom at home. So um, stay tuned for that and we'll show you before and after. So what you do is make sure she's completely brushed out and I would brush everything forward. Okay, so everything's brushed forward and I would just take the scissors and just create a bang right around the eyes. And this is where it can be tough with a puppy because they like to move and you're being an angel. Yes, you are and you're adorable. You're so good. And you don't want to, you still want them to look like a puppy. So see how they have the little round, the bowl, oh, yeah, I know. look at your beautiful eyes. Oh my goodness. So what I'd suggest, because I know it's nerve wracking using sharp scissors, is get the ballpoint scissors. And you can get these real tiny, tiny ones. And just go right in there and just lightly trim the hair that's sticking in her, in her eye. And you don't have to do much. It doesn't take a whole lot. You can just use your fingers to move it up. And she's being so good. And then just keep brushing it forward. Because she's being so good, I'm not gonna use the ballpoint. Just make a V, let go up here, make a V there, and then make a V there. And then you can just trim right on the, the base of her nose because that's where the hair grows really quickly. And then I'm just gonna round her head a bit and using curved scissors helps for that too. And then, like I said, just keep brushing it forward and then you'll know if it's even. And then flip that up a bit can't get over how good she is. She's an angel. Are you adorable? See how fluffy the hair is? Like you have to literally keep poofing it up with the comb because you'll miss spots. And it's so easy to make it uneven. The moment they shake their head, you, you see spots. And then I'm just going to do her beard just a little bit and just round her face. And again, I brush that all forward and just hold her, her nose and jaw tight. Well, relatively tight so that she can't stick her tongue out because she can literally slice her tongue open on the scissors. And that would not be a good scene. Stay hun. Good girl. Good girl. What a good girl you are. Yes, you are. Okay. 
You could use thinning shears there as well. Just with the puppy, the thinning shears can take longer and I don't want it to take any longer. You're beyond delicious. Yes, oh, and she's seepy. Oh, so seepy. Oh, so seepy. <laughs> You have to do this a few times, but I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect if you're doing it at home. If you're grooming and someone's paying you, it, you have to work more on perfection for sure. See how I've missed some there? And the, the noose makes it hard. Like I'm gonna have to take the noose off because the noose holds back here. Let me see. You're a good girl. Hilarious, she's falling asleep. Are you the cutest thing ever? <laughs> so I hope you found this video helpful. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more informative videos.